Thanks for trying to use the Oh, you've got both anyway. Thank you. Cheers. Thank you and all the best. Now oh, we're here in Russian Lust train station and it's daybreak. Uh, that's why I'm wearing the previous vest in the garden is dark. And we're here also not just to meet commuters but to see the improvements that have taken place in the stations along the Northern Suburban Line here and the facilities including tea and coffee and so forth that are now making it much more attractive for people to take the train and to take public transport in general. That's an objective of the Green Party. It's very important that we have good public transport, good taxi service. I want to welcome the taxi regulator's change of heart and the lobbying has now paid off, which I was writing and seeking meetings with her to do away with that nine-year rule that was meaning that people who maintained their taxis were not able to use them after nine years, which was very unenvironmental and bad for business as well. So we have a change in that in the green direction, which is welcome. And that all points to why the Greens, as I was on Morning Ireland talking about it there just a few minutes ago, um, are emphasising that all of these measures are going to help move us away from oil dependency and create employment. And that is a win-win because it saves us importing six billion, which is an increasing uh, bill of uh, fossil fuels into this country every year. So one way or the other, I hope people do vote Green on Friday because it is the way to build jobs, to build resilience, security of energy supply and a reliable future, particularly for our children who otherwise will have a difficult legacy and we want to uh, hand on this uh, country in a condition that helps them to live in a good quality of life. So with that, we'll get back to meeting more commuters here at Russian Bus. Come on,